money was no object, I would definitely get a car. A really nice guitar. A nice mountain bike. A nice computer. Nice house. A plane ticket to Fiji. Nice wardrobe full of clothes. I would travel, travel, travel. A jet. A first class mm. ticket to around the world. <laughs> Technology, as much as I can find, I don't care where it is, all of it. <laughs> Ecclesiastes chapter 7 verse 12 says that money is for protection. We do need money in life for food, shelter and clothing. But uh, the rest of the verse just carries a thought that really wisdom is more important. It's just all about keeping it in a balance. Spending on controllability is like driving blind mm. because you don't know the consequences of mm. your irrational spending. You really aren't even looking where you're going, and you could potentially be heading uh, to a disaster. The Bible tells us to calculate the expense, so we have to watch our spending. I think that having a credit card can be a trap, because you wind up spending money you don't have. Pay your credit card bills as soon as possible. Pay it in full. Don't ever lend your credit card to a friend. It, it, that's just asking for trouble. Se você conseguir, if you can just control your initial reaction, if you resist, when you finally get home, you can ask yourself, do I really need that? It's always been the case where you go out, you've got your goal in mind, something else catches your eye, and before you know it, you're leaving the shop with something that you might not have even knew existed, but now that you've seen it, you wanted it. It's extremely important to learn how to manage money while you're still at home. If you left the house unprepared, it's like being thrown in the deep end of a pool and not knowing how to swim. Ultimately, you just drown. While you're at home, you have limited expenses, so that will allow you to focus on budgeting your funds. And then once you leave home, because you practice that while you're at home, when you have additional things to spend on, you're gonna be ready.